My name is Vivian Ayo Ephraim. I am a plus size model and student living in London. So the story of how I got into modeling is quite interesting because I was with my mum. She was like, why don't you get into modeling? Like you do like commercials and acting and things like that. And she was like, yeah, just do it. I applied to a competition on Star Now that would have won me a contract with Bridge Models, which it did, I did win it. So that's how it all started. So when I got, you know, the email, oh, you have a casting for ASOS, I was like, what do I do, what do I do? Still the same nerves, but you know, I just went there, did what I usually do, just stand there, do my best, take my pictures and be as confident as I can, which I think I did well, because I got it in me. <laughs> the recognition and like feedback and, and the comments and everything by every, literally every single person I bump into or across social media, it's been amazing. Like, I don't think I have any kind of words to, to kind of describe the feeling, but it's, a, it's an amazing feeling that I feel inside, honest. Um, it's also amazing because a lot, I see a lot of people that look like me, a lot of people of colour, people that are plus size, just like I am, you know, say, oh, I've seen someone that represents me, finally, things like that. It's really encouraging to see. So I would like to work for Sports Illustrated because I saw some of the I'd look up to on that. Um, that was Ashley Graham. I thought she did an amazing job on it and it's just given so many other people like me and something to work towards to um, in terms of showing ourselves, you know, to the world. And on a platform like that as well, I feel like it's now becoming very inclusive as well. So that's something that I'd definitely love to take part in. So representation is very, 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 very important. I can't stress how important it is, um, only because there's so many people that from young ages look up to certain people and certain things that are happening across social media, across the world, not even social media, just generally. Um, for me, representation is very important because I've had so many young people message me to say, oh, I want to be just like you. And I'm just like, Oh my God, that's a lot, but it's something that needs to, you know, be normalised. So something like this that, that's happened via ASOS should be everywhere. So not, not everyone's kind of surprised by what's going on, but it will get better. I'll just say that I'm very positive. So I reckon it will get, it will get there. I would like the modelling industry in the future, if it was up to me, to be inclusive. That's the one word I can stress on, inclusiveness. There shouldn't be categories as to plus size, mo plus size model or a normal model or this model, that model. I think it should just be that person is a model, regardless of whatever it is they look like, what shape it is, what size, how tall, how short they are. If I had the power to, everyone would be a model. <laughs> um, I love Nike. I have like so many... I'm basically, I'm not endorsed by them, but I love it. It's an amazing brand. Um,